In this video, we're going to be talking about tooth removal in a cat, specifically the first premolar that has two roots. Here, what we can see is the tooth will be sectioned off with a high speed cutting bit. This allows us to separate and work on each root individually. Now what we're doing is we're using a sharp dental elevator. This is inserted between the socket and the root and what we're doing is we're breaking down those ligaments that are holding the tooth in place in that gum socket area. So we give it a good little wiggle there. So placing a lot of tension and torque and torsion on that area, on that tooth, hoping that these ligaments break down and allow us to pull that root from the socket. There we go, it's nearly ready to come out. And there we go, we can remove that one root of that tooth. Now we do the same thing with the second root, giving it a little bit of a wiggle and that's going to come nice and easily. Now there's a bit of a hole that's left over when, when we remove a tooth. Now not all teeth require suturing, but this one's a decent sort of hole that could actually mean food gets trapped in here. So we're going to use absorbable suture to suture this area up. As I said, it's absorbable suture, and what that means is that once the tissue's healed, this suture will actually dissolve over time, and so there's no need for us to come back in afterwards to remove these sutures. They will dissolve in their own time. We've got to remember that tooth removal in cats is not a temporary solution, it's actually permanent, and it's definitely non-reversible. However, it is a really effective way at removing constant pain and discomfort that has been caused by diseased teeth. Not all situations of course need tooth removal. Sometimes we might choose to do a root canal therapy or some other sort of orthod orthodontic treatment. Here we can see the two tooth roots of the tooth that was removed. 